toes till I get up. Guys, as you see, I'm here cutting up some chicken. I am going to do some stew chicken today. So I'm going to show you how I do my stew chicken. So normally when I'm stewing chicken, I cut it, um, well, cut my chicken small, similar to when I'm doing a curry chicken. So I'm just cutting up my chicken, guys, and I'm going to show you how I stew my chicken. Just remember that brown stew chicken and stew chicken is different as I am not going to brown my chicken first. So that is why it's called stew chicken because you're just going to um, prepare it without browning the chicken first basically. Yeah, so I'm just going to cut my finish cutting this chicken up and then I show you how I do my stew chicken. Yes guys, so this is the ingredients I'm going to be working with today to do my stew chicken. So I've got a couple bell peppers, onion, um, about two cloves of garlic, some um, spring onions, scallion. I'm going to put on the meat some garlic granite, chicken seasoning, some paprika. And I'm going to also work with tomato ketchup, some sweet chili, and some browning as well. So I'm going to just chop my um, bell peppers now and my onions, garlic, and then I'm going to show you exactly how it's done, guys. Well, the sweet fam way. So that is our things just chopped up and ready. Yeah. Okay, guys. So here I've got my chicken. I like to do uh, my chicken small. I cut my chicken small when I'm doing a stewed chicken. So I'm just gonna add a bit of um, garlic, um, garlic granites. Some chicken seasoning. some paprika guys of course you can add whatever seasoning you want to add to your chicken but this is what I am using on my chicken I'm just gonna rub that in okay make sure every bit gets a little Bit of seasoning onto it. I'm going to also leave this for like a, between 15 to minutes to half an hour before I start cooking it. Okay, so that's that. I'm just gonna put that aside for at least 15 minutes, guys. Okay, now, guys. So I'm going to just pour some oil just to cover the bottom of the pot as I'm going to um, stir fry my um, sweet peppers, garlic, onion and spring onions. Scallion as we know it in back home. Okay, so we just cover the bottom of the pot with some oil. And then I am going to add um, about half, half of um, the sweet peppers, onions, and my scallion, spring onion. Um, I'm going to add it to the pot now. Okay, 
going to stir fry these off before I add my tomato ketchup browning and sweet chili. Just want to get all the flavor. Add some tomato sauce. I'm going to add now some sweet chili. About three teaspoon of sweet chili. About three teaspoons of tomato ketchup. I am going to add about two teaspoon of browning and then I'm just going to mix all of those together guys. my chicken guys guys so I'm just gonna leave that to cook for a little just like that without the pot closing or anything just it will create its own liquid because we don't want too much water in it at the moment so we're just gonna leave that to simmer for like the next maybe five to ten minutes so we're just gonna leave that guys Turn it occasionally. maybe five minutes guys okay guys Smelling so lovely guys, so lovely smelling, it's so lovely right now. So now guys, I am going to put like half cup of water just to ensure that there's enough liquid to cook this meat thoroughly. So now guys, I'm going to add about half a cup of water. Also, I'm going to 
add about half teaspoon of um, the chicken seasoning, just a little bit more to bring up the taste. And if you want, you can add a bit more salt or whatever seasoning of your preference as I am trying to reduce the amount of salt intake I try to use very little or as little as um, seasoning or salt guys guys I'm also going to add a little bit of jerk sauce to this to bring up the flavor guys so I'm just checking in back on my chicken and it's almost cooked now guys it's almost here let me just taste it to see how it tastes mm, yeah I think I'm gonna add a little bit more sweet chili delicious smelling so nice and yes guys it's tasting very nice as well is all done now guys I am going to turn off my hob and I'm going to serve this guys and I'll show you when I serve this with some rice and peas so lovely with your white rice rice and peas mush whatever you choose to have it with very delicious Okay guys, so here we go. Here is our brown stewed chicken. We served it with some rice and peas, plantains and some cabbage with a drizzle of carrot. So please leave us a little message down below us a comment guys let me know what do you think of our stewed chicken I will do a brown stewed chicken in the future thanks for watching 
subscribe, like, and share. See you in the next vlog, guys.